anyone else bored at home? I am. And I've got a bunch of lights that uh, I would like to use and I figured maybe I can come up with uh, as many creative lighting setups as I can today. And so that's what we're doing. Oh, and today's episode is sponsored by Epidemic Sound. And so uh, more on them in just a second. Ah, found it. This is a $10 lantern from Ikea. When I saw this light, I was like, I'm gonna make a video about this light. That was like two years ago. But I suppose better late than never. I should probably explain what I'm about to do. So uh, the first setup, I'm gonna be using the Ikea lantern, the $10 Ikea lantern. Behind me is my Aperture 120D studio light. So for this setup, I wanna see if this $10 Ikea lantern is good enough to use as a key light. Yeah, that's, uh, that's not gonna cut it. <laughs> Look at that, that's much, much better. All right, let's go test it out. All right, this is the uh, lighting from the Aperture 120D Mark II. Looks pretty good, pretty clean. Now, let's go ahead and try our lantern. Hmm, not too shabby. Closer to the light. Not bad, not bad at all. And so for the next lighting setup, we're gonna use a projector. Woo, look at that. What? That's actually pretty good for a small projector. All right, I'm gonna pull down the backdrop for this effect to work, so hang tight. Love it, love it! All right, so I'm projecting this really cool motion graphic. It's a video preview from Motion Array. I'm missing one more element just to create some texture for what I'm going for, and that's haze. And so I got this little fog machine that I got from Amazon, and uh, I'm just gonna just pump out a little bit of haze. I'm gonna use a reflector just to like spread the haze around because it's gonna make for a really cool effect. Ready? Woo! Oh, where's my reflector? Okay, let's go ahead and shoot this thing. All right, so next setup, we're gonna use uh, some RGB lights. And uh, I got some brand new RGB lights from a company called Nanlite. They're really cool. Let me, uh, let me show you. All right, so these are Nanlites, and this is the Pabo Tube 30C. And then check this out. Turn it on. Boom. Turn this guy on. Boom. Uh, you can actually change the color uh, by using these little dials right over here. There we go. Change different colors. So whatever you want, really. Cool, uh, let's go with, oh yeah, pink and teal. Let's do that, okay. This side, right. All right, here we go. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, that was really fun. All right, so I'm gonna prepare for the next setup, but before I do, let's talk about today's sponsor, Epidemic Sound. Uh, I'm pretty sure you've heard of Epidemic Sound. Pretty much every content creator out there has used Epidemic Sound. They're amazing. And if you haven't heard of them, they are a music licensing platform where you can download incredible music for your YouTube videos, your commercial work, and more. For me, music really drives the story of my videos. And with the library from Epidemic Sound and just the constant new music that they always put out, it's very easy for me to find the right song for my video. All right, so this is the Epidemic Sound homepage. And right off the bat, on the banner, they show you uh, new and trending albums, as well as new songs that have been chosen by the staff. You can check out some of the songs there or you can browse through their library. And if you hear a song that you like, you can save it to a playlist. And so let's go ahead and check out uh, the music that I've saved. And if you look over to the left of the screen, I've made some folders for specific types of videos. If ever I hear a song that I think would fit that specific type of video. So for example, let's go ahead and go to Head Boppers. Uh, oh, this one I like. <laughs> Good, right? Made a folder for vlogs, so let's go ahead and listen to some of the songs I've chosen for potential vlogs. Just good, good music. What's great is that not only does Epidemic Sound have music, but they got a great collection of sound effects as well. Here on the sound effects page, there are different categories that you can choose from. You got whooshes, ambiance, footsteps, weather, 
animals. You get the point. So music, sound effects. There are different plans that you can choose from. You can either go with a personal plan or a commercial plan. If you opt for the personal plan, and that's for like typical content creators on YouTube, you get unlimited downloads of tracks and sound effects. All the music is cleared for YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch, and podcasts. And if you sign up now using my link down in the description below, you get to try Epidemic Sound for free. 30 days for free. With a commercial plan, you get everything else that comes with the personal plan and more. You get clearance to use any song and sound effect for all client productions. Your license is covered through all online platforms, unlimited use in digital ads. And of course, you get a free 30 day trial if you use my link in the description below. All right, well, we're gonna get back to lighting, but thanks Epidemic Sound for sponsoring this video. All right, so next setup that I wanna do is to fake sunlight. And I'm going to do that by using the Aperture 120D, that's right behind me, and the Aperture Spotlight Mount. And what that does is that it focuses the light to create a spotlight, a narrow beam of light, and that's what I want. I want a concentrated narrow beam of light to emulate sunlight going through some windows. And so here's what it looks like. Let me turn it on. 65%. Boom. Boom, look at that, how cool is that? All right, so here's the setup. I'm in my room and uh, I'll, be, I'll be set up over there on that side of the bed. And uh, through that window, I'm gonna shine that Aperture 120D and the spotlight mount through the window. And then I'm gonna add some haze just so I can see the beams of light coming through the window. And hopefully we can fake some pretty sunlight. Oh, I gotta see this thing. Oh, <laughs> look at that. This is crazy. <laughs> it's like a bazooka. A bazooka of light. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go place this light outside. Hang tight. <laughs> okay. <sighs> That's good. I had to <laughs> had to run power through the other window over there. I just. Oh gosh, I'm not fit for this. Okay, so now we've created our little sunlight using the spotlight mount, which is great because now it's created this. That's, that's really, really good. Okay, so the kids are doing the haze for me. I brought in my other 120D. I'm gonna put the light dome. I'm gonna shine a little bit light over there just to, just to make the scene pop a little bit. But what I really, really, really want is uh, that sunlight bleeding through the windows. Let's get here. Oh. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that, that's beautiful, beautiful. All right, so that's my whole setup over there. Uh, let's see what it looks like on camera. All right, come on, let's go read the story. Let's go read the story. There we go, we are reading. All right, and the last setup, we're gonna do some product photography lighting. And so over here, I got my 120D Mark II all set up with the Light Dome Mark II softbox set up. Uh, I've got these backdrops over here, these photography backdrops by uh, Replica Surfaces. Uh, there's different types, just like the subway tile, there's dark wood. So we're just gonna play around, use some just objects and do some pretty cool product photography lighting. Uh, yeah, I like it. I, I like that a lot. Uh, pro tip, the closer the light is to the subject or object, the softer the lighting looks. Uh, I think we're ready to go. That's pretty much my setup and so, here we go. All right, for this setup, I've uh, I put another replica surface and uh, I'm using it as a bounce. I'm gonna bounce light, just like that. Just light, bouncing, boom. And we're done, and I am tired. Woo, wow, that was a, uh, that was, uh, that was quite the day. But hey, uh, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for joining me as I try to come up with some cool creative lighting setups. And a big thanks to Epidemic Sound for sponsoring this video. And if you wanna check them out for free, definitely click the link in the description below. But I'm out of here, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Woo!